I'm Shanti. Welcome to 29th of October Scholarly Blessing. The word I, all namely, Mera and me. This word has created all the problem in the world. And God is saying that you come over here on this earth for a short period of time. But you have got so much of consciousness of I and mine that you are creating all the troubles in your life. And your distance from me is increasing day by day. That means you are going far away from the truth, far away from the creator. God says, may you become a pure soul by merging yourself in the ocean of love. And who is that? Ocean of love is God. But you are making everybody else as a source of ocean of love. Then it is a mistake because nobody on earth, especially in Kali or the Iron Age, is an ocean of love other than God. And if you are seeking love from others, respect from others, then we are in a wrong place. We are seeking in the wrong place, we are in the wrong direction and we are going to be disappointed. God says, may you be, become a pure soul by merging yourself in the ocean of love and finishing the dirt of the consciousness of I. God is calling it as dirt of consciousness of I. Those who constantly remain merged in the ocean of love are not aware of anything of the world. That means they don't have anything to take from anything in the world. That means it doesn't mean that they are arrogant or they are jealous or they are selfish, those souls, or they don't care. No, they care about everything but they don't want anything or they don't expect or they don't crave for anything from others whether it's love, whether it's importance, whether it's respect, whether it's name, fame they don't want anything else that's what it means that they are not aware of anything of the world because of being merged in love they are easily able to go beyond all situations they merged in whose love? God's love that's why they are able to overcome all situations in their life as coming to other people it is said of devotees this one is constantly lost in whom? In the creator or he is lost in devotion. However, you children are constantly merged in love. So, in devotion, we call God as God or Supreme Soul or God or we call him as Bhagwan or we call him as the creator. But when we are his child, we call him as Father. God, Father or Baba. So, God says... It is said of devotees, this one is constantly lost. However, you children are constantly merged in love. You are not aware of the world or the consciousness of mine has finished. Nothing is mine. You don't feel any sense of loss in anything. The consciousness of mine for many things makes you dirty. When we think of everything as mine, then we are fighting to protect it. Then we are arguing about it. Then we are jealous with others. If we have got mine is less and theirs mine is more. We might be greedy. We might have all the dirt in our mind because of mine. So God says, when you consider the father to be mine as compared to the things and the attainments of the world to be mine, all the dirt finishes and the soul becomes pure. To learn how to have God as mine is what we learn in Brahma Kumaris because the relationship is very divine and pure as compared to with things and people around us. You are most welcome to learn this beautiful mind, the real true God as mind and Brahma Kumaris. Om Shanti Udas.